Morning, welcome back to today's Windows and Doors. My name's Donna. And when choosing your front entry door, there's so many decisions to be made. One very important decision is the type of glass, if you want glass at all, in your new door. So let's talk about some glass options that you could have. For example, in this AAW wood door, we have a cathedral style door with a little bit of glue chip, beveling, and of course you have your brass camming design here. So again, when choosing the glass for your front door, there's many things to consider. And of course that's the size and shape of the amount of glass that you might want. Here's an example of a smaller piece of glass, a half moon, just at the top of the door with beautiful zinc camming. Of course there's options without glass for someone who wants complete privacy. And then of course many different shapes and different amounts of, uh, of obscurity. As you can see through this glass you can see the door behind it but not real clearly. Camming colors are usually zinc, brass, or black with uh, different uh, levels of obscurity being from 1 to 10 and of course 10 is the most obscure where you cannot make out any figure and often not even light coming through the door. This is a great example of another cathedral style door with black camming in a white painted door. Looks beautiful. Fiberglass door, again your oval and this is a three-quarter piece of glass with uh, several different glass designs within the pattern and black camming. More recently you're seeing more and more wrought iron and full glass doors. This is a beautiful example. Through the glass you can make out what's on the other side. So there's not a lot of privacy, but a very beautiful door. So when choosing your front door, there's lots of things to consider. Whether it is wood or fiberglass, painted or stained, how much glass, how much privacy, and of course, another option is your hardware. So give us a call at today's Windows and Doors.